Okay, I just had what I think is my shortest Uber Eats delivery. <laughs> it's going to be very difficult to have one closer than this. It was from McDonald's. And this one I will always remember just because of what it was. So, so I pull up to McDonald's and everything, go inside. I, I checked a little menu on the uh, app here to see what it was. It was a cheeseburger, small fries, and a small Coke. Instantly when I see this, I'm thinking to myself, this seems like an awful small order to be getting for delivery. I mean, it, it's going to cost three, maybe four bucks for the food. The delivery charge is going to be more than what the food is. But, so, no big deal. Go inside. Of course, the order's ready. It doesn't take long to make this one. They got it in the nice little bag and everything. Stick it in my delivery warm bag and uh, I continue that get to the delivery part and it says delivery time one minute so I'm looking at it and it's an, a nearby apartment building I walk outside and I could see the front door of the apartment building from where I'm parked just blew my mind so, well, like any delivery, I, I just get in the car. I drive the short distance there, and she's standing outside waiting for it. I mean, it, just like any other delivery, you know, stop. She got her food, she went inside, I went to take off, and the whole time I'm thinking to myself, why would you just not walk over and get it? It's, it must have been two blocks. So I, I get back, I look in the app from what she paid Uber and she gave me a $2 tip on top of it. She paid almost twice the amount to have it delivered than the meal cost. Just, I don't know if you could top it, but in this market, I'm glad people will do that because that just leaves other drivers out here the ability to make some money. So until next time, happy trips.